I just watched the video by Snake FPV. It was a cool video. He had Mr. Steel on the channel for that video, and together they tested the difference between air mode and idle up mode with the KISS flight controller. And uh, I thought it was really cool, and ultimately they found out or they decided that um, idle up actually gave you a little better control. Um, you know, when you were uh, zero throttle in the air. So I was right. Right, okay. Wow. But what was interesting to me and what I'm making this video for is at the end of that video, they addressed an issue with idle up that most people have. And you have to have two switches to arm. To rearm, you have to hit one because it's a consecutive switching of switches so yeah. like you have to arm first yeah. and then you have to do the throttle cut afterwards if the throttle cuts in this position and you disarm and then try to rearm it won't rearm because the throttle is not below 1050 yeah basically what he says when you're talking about idle up mode if you arm the quad go into air mode or idle up mode if you disarm the quad you have to flip it back down into regular non air mode or idle up mode arm it and then you can go back and idle it up back into air mode so on my radio here this switch here is arm and this switch is my mode selector switch I actually have um, what I would call acro mode and the middle selection would be air mode and the bottom selection would be level mode and air mode is actually uh, an idle up is basically what that is but it gives you the ability to have three modes on a switch so, um, but the difference is, I can flip this into idle up mode and arm the quad, and the quad will arm. And this is a KISS flight controller. Um, I, you can see it's in there with everything else in the stack. So, let me, let me show you what I'm talking about. So, if I turn my radio on, all right, and uh, Acro mode. I do have sounds. Air mode, level mode. They give you an idea Air mode. Acro mode. of what mode I'm in. Fun little sounds for arming and disarming. And uh, let me show you what I'm talking about with the quad. So let me come on the other side of the camera here and plug the quad in. And yeah, I, I took the props off because otherwise it would be dangerous to show you this. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to uh, arm the quad in um, non idle up mode or acro mode. Okay. And if I pick the quad up, I can move it around and it doesn't react. The gyros are disabled and just kind of idle spinning right now. And then if I flip the switch down one, Air mode. you can actually hear it Acro mode. Air mode. slightly idle up. And the gyros... Um, react. So I'm still in idled up state with the switch. So the problem with this now is when I flip the arm switch, they, the quad shouldn't arm until I put it back into to non idle up mode. Acro Go back into that mode. Let's go back into Air that mode. mode. Hey, oh, would you look at that? Hell, level mode. let's test it in level mode. Ooh, acts like level mode with the idle all the way down. Okay. All right, all right. Let's go acro mode. Acro mode make sure it's reacting the way it should. Okay, that's working. Disarm it. Air mode. Hey! Well, ain't that something? So, with OpenTX, it's a very powerful firmware. It's actually uh, like programming, you know, with a programming language when you're setting this thing up. 
gives you the ability to do some things that you can't do with anything else. And one of them is uh, to be able to set this up so that you can have an idle up switch and not have to flip it back down out of the idle up mode so that you can have your your quote air mode okay so I'd be willing to do a video about how to set the radio up to do this um, and I would go into depth and explain how it works and show you step by step how to do it um, but I'd only do that if there was a serious interest to see that so if you want me to go ahead and do that video to show you how to set the radio up so that you can actually disarm in idle up mode and rearm in idle up mode and then you pretty much do that in any flight mode and have three flight modes or you know you can basically do whatever you want you can have you know non idle up mode and idle up mode and disarm and arm in either of them which is the way it should be so if there is an interest let me know leave a comment give me a thumbs up something and I'll go ahead and make that video so in the meantime, you know, have fun flying.